Police are searching for a group of thieves who stole dozens of ATMs from businesses in Queens and Brooklyn over the last few months. CBS 2's Natalie Dudridge spoke to staff who say they got away with tens of thousands of dollars. Surveillance video shows a man dressed in black pull an ATM machine off the wall and drag it through a deli on Fulton Street in East New York. The suspect pushes it over to a broken window where an accomplice is waiting. The pair appear to try to figure out how to get the machine out of the store. I don't see how they did that though. I'm trying to figure it out. Police are too. They're looking for a group of five seemingly professional burglars who hit 42 businesses across Queens and Brooklyn over the last six months. Not just robbing registers, but stealing entire ATM machines. They broke in the door, the glass, they knocked it down. On May 12th at 2 a.m., they hit the Country House Diner at 887 Fulton Street and ripped the ATM off the wall. Trying to grab the machine, they couldn't make it out with it because it's too heavy. That same night, two hours later, security video shows two men smash the door at Wholesome Farms Market across the street at 840 Fulton Street. They break the door and then they try to, to get some money inside and then they couldn't. Since December, the suspects have hit smoke shops, delis, nail salons, barber shops, grocery stores, and donut shops. All of the thefts have happened overnight when stores are closed. They close the stores. They break the window and they do the strip. Police say in total they made off with more than $60,000 worth of cash. Fortunately, no one was hurt in any of the incidents. The police didn't, you know, so far they didn't do nothing with us. Investigators are asking the public for tips, hoping to prevent a 43rd robbery. In East New York, Brooklyn, Natalie Dudridge, CBS 2 News.